a suggestion which many people have talked about, that either cold weather or hot weather can kill the coronavirus. It's amazing how these urban myths arise. And what you have to look at it is cause and effect. And it's very easy to muddle the two up and make different conclusions. So it goes like this. In the cooler times, in the winter period, we're more indoors. So our environment is indoors and we are inside houses where transmission of such infections is a lot easier. In the summer months, we're more outdoors. And as a result of being more outdoors, we have fewer infections, fewer possibilities for infections, and therefore infections go down. That doesn't mean the virus has gone to sleep. It's just that our environment, our habits, what we are doing has changed, and hence the reduction in the summer months and the increase in the winter months. I think people are confusing two things. One is, um, is, is hot weather going to reduce the spread of the coronavirus versus does heat kill the virus itself? And there's two completely different things. Um, there isn't enough evidence that studies in China have been suggesting that the that the difference is minuscule. A lot of people take um, the Asian countries, such as uh, South Korea and Singapore, as an example. But Korea has got other public health measures that have been in place, and because of that, the transmission hasn't been as much as other countries. Um, now, uh, Australia, on the other hand, has also um, got the coronavirus, and in the southern hemisphere, it is, um, or it was, summer during uh, the December and January. 